Okay, people can hear me. I'm delighted to see such a big turnout. I guess that says something about banking. In America, in Western Europe, up until two years ago, everybody wanted to become a banker. And now, it's one of those dirty words like becoming a lawyer. But that will pass. Banking will be popular again in America because bankers are needed. Banking is the oil that lubricates the economy. And Kosovo has been blessed by having a banking sector that is very conservatively managed, very well regulated, and very modern. Banking is one of Kosovo's success stories. So I'm extremely glad to see four banks represented here who are going to be making presentations to you today. I'm extremely grateful to the people who have organized this, and particularly to Dr. Besni Bislimi. And also to Ilir Ibrahimi, who is going to moderate the panel. So once again, welcome to all of our friends from the banking sector. And now, over to Ilir. Well, uh, I will begin by inviting our panelists here today to sit on the table here, and I will do the presentation with each one of them. This. <clears throat> Dr. Hall kindly introduced the people here attending this event today. Uh, the banking sector is really one of the most interesting uh, sectors here in Kosovo and uh, I know that most of you are interested in that business and what they do and what they require. The reason why we put this together and the idea comes from Dr. Bislini again, to talk to you, to talk to the people who will be hiring you tomorrow, of the skills, of the things that you really need to have in order to, go, uh, to be able to go work in a bank. Now, fortunately enough, uh, three of the four people in the panel today are former AOK graduates. So that means that we are doing something right for the banks, at least till now. But again, we will talk, we will keep this in a very informal way. Uh, we will not have big presentations like you have to have A, B, C, Ds and everything. But each one of the, the representatives of the bank will do an introduction of their, their bank, and I'm sure they all will say that their bank is the best and everything, but it's up to you to, to really to do the evaluation and everything. So, and uh, they promised me they're going to hire today 40 people, right now. <laughs> so, <laughs> I don't know how many of you want to go to work right away. So, uh, I will do the introduction of the people to, uh, presented today, and I'm not uh, of the importance of the bank, but uh, as the people arrived, so the earliest arrivals are the first on the list. So, we'll start, uh, start with Nasera Bazi, who will be representing the bank upper business, against uh, Georgian Garaibaisen, What does that mean? You guys have a council in Raiffeisen? Yeah. All right. <laughs> Goneta Batali from Bukata. Bukata Kontale Tekana. And Alpina Mehta from Procredit. Yeah. So again, Nasir, we'll start with you. And we, again, keep it informed. Tell us about your bank. What are you guys looking for? And, and, and this, again, we, it's a conversation among friends. That's the way I would like to, to present this to you. Uh, hello everyone, my name is Nasser Abwaze and I'm working for Bank for Business. I'm a coordinate, branch coordinator and I head also the marketing department. Um, as you are, uh, well, you once I was a AAP student, I graduated in 2007. Ever since I've been working in banks mostly, most of my career, five years now. Um, bank for Business has been established in 2001 by uh, local uh, shareholders. Basically, the bank is a, uh, ha uh, its capital is, is driven by uh, local. Um, it's the first bank actually, all the other banks, they come from other countries. Uh, this is what we actually distinguish from other banks because we come from the, uh, from the deep of the, the uh, basically of this society. 
Um, um, our bank has about 40 brands around Kosovo. We pretty much uh, established in uh, all other area, uh, areas of Kosovo, as you include Pristina, Gina, Perizai, Peja, Prizdaja, Jankova, Mitrovica, among other sub branches as well. We are about 300, uh, around 300 people working currently in the bank, about 216 working in the branches. Basically, working in, we have very much very good established base in the in the, in the units. Um, we, as any other bank, we are very much uh, we are uh, um, organized in a uh, very modest structure. We have like uh, the head of the bank, uh, deputies. We have uh, divisions, sectors, and for, uh, so forth. Um, our bank uh, is one of the best banks in the uh, in the industry as well. Uh, uh, the staff working currently in the bank are very highly qualified. Uh, people who have used to work in other banks as well, very successful, and uh, some of the people that um, basically are professors, if I may say. Um, uh, we uh, have different products, uh, all of, like banks' products, starting from deposits, uh, loans. Uh, we have very sophisticated, as well as like e-banking. Um, what we distinguish from other banks is like our current uh, customer service. That's what our uh, uh, quality is, or we differ differentiate from other banks. Um, when it comes to us, as I said, well, um, we are very, uh, as uh, Chris Bruce said, we are very conservative as well. We uh, qualify, uh, we employ very qualified people. Um, uh, usually, what we look for, we look for people who are well educated, highly motivated, and looking for for challenging in life. Um, some of the uh, some of the qualities of the person in order to uh, to apply for a job, some of the qualities we're looking for is that the person must have organizational skills. Uh, uh, it must be detail oriented because this is a bank we deal with a very sensitive issue which is the money. It's uh, money of the people who are safe for, for years and now we are looking, we are working with that money as well. So we have to be detail oriented. Detail -oriented. Um, we basically, as I said, detail oriented, that could also uh, include mathematics. We use a lot of mathematics. We use also a computer, computerized system which helps us to do all the math and the calculation. Uh, we need people who know accounting, bookkeeping. We know uh, people who are familiar with the industry, with the bank in the general. Um, a person who has a very uh, good communication skill. Because we are working on the different levels of the organization that we need to communicate. The communication is a very important part of, uh, of the entire business. And of course, the person, and as I said previously, we are dealing with a very sensitive issue that's people's money, and the person must be honest and uh, has a person who has integrity. And of course, other traits as well. Um, now we. Uh, Thank you. We are continuing with Gens now. Gens Gloria from Raiffeisen. Uh, okay. If if I start talking about uh, Raiffeisen, it will take too long. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Nasser, uh, Nasser was an uh, employee of Raiffeisen earlier and student of AUK. So uh, what I want to say is that we are all living in Kosovo and we may change banks or institution, uh, but the, the values remain with us wherever we go. So competition is not that important because tomorrow we may be somewhere else. Uh, what we hope to have to see in applicants in Raiffeisen are uh, first to say that I believe all of you qualify to get employed in Raiffeisen with your, with your uh, knowledge that you gain from AUK University and I say this freely because we have had students from AUK in the past five years doing internship in Raiffeisen Bank and many of them got employed afterwards. So from knowledge-wise, you all qualify. Uh, from from uh, personality-wise, what I would like to suggest that you develop is self-knowledge. It's a self-knowing yourself. Huh? It's a competence that, uh, from my experience, very few people in Kosovo develop or want to develop. That includes uh, criticizing your 